Hello everybody and welcome to today's video. Today I'm coming to you from the floor of my bedroom and I thought I'd try a new angle. But today I want to talk about having a boring life and that I think having a boring life is absolutely okay. And I'm saying this not out of the position of an expert or anything like that. I'm very much also telling that myself, that having a boring life is totally fine. Having a boring life is not something you need to avoid at any cost. So I just wanted to share my experience and thoughts with you and I hope you can get some value from that as well. Having a boring life itself is not a problem. The problem just starts when we are not okay with it being boring. I think a term that we can talk about here is the fear of missing out. Missing out is not a problem at all, but the fear of missing out is, and that is actually a quote from one of the minimalists. I don't remember who of them said it, but I think that is very true for a boring life as well. And it also yeah, has something to do with that. So living a life where not many things change without extraordinary adventures or crazy things happening all the time is not a problem. And it can be quite enjoyable, it can be great, it can be chosen by us to just have a calm and balanced life. The problem only begins when we start looking at other people's lives, whether that is on Instagram, on YouTube, in real life, people on the streets and wondering why they seem to have a life that is so perfect and exciting and ours is boring and dull. But what we cannot forget is that we always only see a little bit. And especially when it comes to pictures on Instagram, people tend to share their most exciting stuff. They don't tend to share their problems and struggles and boring times and annoying things that come up when you try to live an extraordinary life. And I realize that I keep falling into that trap too, especially when it comes to the content I create here on YouTube, because a lot of that revolves around my life. And so in order to present you something valuable, something exciting, something you can learn from, I feel like I need to have an exciting life. I feel like my boring life might not be enough. And the thing is that for myself, for my personal life, Aside from my whole YouTube channel, I feel absolutely okay with my life. Sure, I'd like to travel a bit more because I really haven't been traveling for the past two years, but that is not really because of me, that's because of the whole situation we're in worldwide. But apart from that, I'm really happy with my life. I really do things that I like to do on a day-to-day -day basis. It doesn't need to be something new each day. It just needs to be things that I actually like spending my time on. So I love cooking every day. I love going for walks. I am really happy to go to bed each day and have a good night's sleep. I like watching YouTube videos, reading books, knitting things, spending time doing nothing or just spend time with my family. I'm absolutely okay with these mundane, boring things. But when it comes to my content, I often feel like that's not enough. But I've also realized that that is a strange thought because how could I expect that my life is exciting enough that I have two valuable lessons or even more to share each week so that each video or even additionally each Instagram post or a podcast I could start, additional videos on YouTube have a really valuable lesson in them. And so I am currently trying to balance these two things. Building a life for myself that I really feel happy with, that I am absolutely okay with being a bit boring as well maybe, and finding lessons and things and topics in my everyday life, learning enough to be able to provide you with two good videos each week. And I'm trying and I'm absolutely aware that they are not perfect. I'm absolutely aware that I have certain topics that um, come up again and again, maybe because they're prominent in my life, maybe because you seem to like them a lot, or just because I come up with topics that revolve around these things. And so I think there is a difference between living an exciting life for yourself or living a life that you are happy with and with my personal situation where I really don't want to waste your time. So I do want to present something good for you 
two times each week. But I also realized that I am putting myself under a bit of pressure. I try to make better and better videos. I try to have something really valuable that I feel like, yeah, is worth watching. And maybe I'm a bigger critic than I need to be because nobody makes you watch these videos. If you don't want to watch them, you just don't watch them. And I am so, so thankful for all of you who do choose to watch them, who do think that they are valuable and enjoy watching them, even maybe if not every minute is perfectly curated, even though there is maybe not 10 new valuable life lessons in each piece I put out. And so I feel like I have become a bit of a perfectionist under the pressure of myself, the YouTube algorithm, and also the numbers I see in my YouTube analytics. But one of my most important values is being authentic and just sharing my thoughts and experiences here with you. So that is what I'm doing. I am maybe a boring person because I think about the same topics again and again, because I do not have many friends I meet all the time, because I do not have many adventures and my days pretty much look the same each and every day. That might be the case, but it is okay for me. But so what I'm doing now is making a video about exactly that. Because I want to be honest, because I want to share that with you, and because I think a lot of us feel like our life or our personality in general is maybe boring. There's maybe not that much change. There's maybe not that many life lessons. You maybe do not um, get better at things as fast as you see people on the internet or people around you. And so I'm just here telling you that in my life there are not, most of the time there are not really, two lessons each week that totally change my life, that I um, am able to implement into my life to become a better person, not even 1% each day, and that is totally fine. Like I am learning, I am sharing here with you and I'm sharing this as well because I think that is a thing that I'm learning. That is something that does make me more successful maybe, but it is certainly something that makes me more happy or more at peace with myself because I have learned over the past two years more and more that I do not care as much about the extraordinary things as I thought. Yes, adventures are nice. Yes, new experiences are wonderful. But what's really, really important is that you do have a good base, that you do have a good everyday rhythm, that you have habits and things that make you happy, or at least that you are content with. So please let me know how that is in your life. Do you feel like a very exciting, extraordinary person, or do you feel boring sometimes as well? And things can always change. So maybe there's going to be a phase that is really extraordinary in my life or in your life. But I think the boring phases are good for reflecting, for learning, um, to be happy with what we have, focusing on the everyday things that make our life good. I hope you liked this video and if you did, you can give it a thumbs up to support my channel. And if you want to support my channel even further, you can also think about becoming a member you can find the button for that next to the subscribe button. And now I also want to link you a video here and a playlist here that you can watch if you have time now and if you want to. And I also am looking forward to see you next time. Bye.